Hey, what's going on traders? This is Talon2303 with Trade Lab. I am coming to you today with a, another strategy build video. The main full build is going to be on Trade Lab's YouTube channel, and that will be in a link in the description below. It looks like it actually may enter a trade right now, so this will be a good time to explain and make sure the variables are working. First, I want to say this is not financial advice. I am not saying that this strategy is going to work the way the original video maker said. I found a video by Trade IQ that makes claims of being able to turn $100 into $13,000 over a period of a few months, I think it said. But he was also risking like 5% per trade, which I am not going to do because I'm just trying this out for the first time right now. But we will see if this strategy is actually possible. If you are going to copy the strategy, which you will be able to do after you watch this video, I will share it in the community browser on Trade Lab. If you do copy it, I suggest trying it on paper trading first. Don't risk any money. You don't need to. I'm going to do that a little bit, see if it works, but we can leave in the comments below if it works for you or any changes you think may need to be made. Also, leave in the comments any strategies you'd like to see me build in Trade Lab. I'll go through the entire build on Trade Lab's channel. I'll just show you an overview on this channel. So, the strategy that I found today is from Trade IQ. It's called chat GBT, GPT trading strategy turns $100 into $13,000 full strategy. So I've got this built in here and I will tell you about the indicators and the rules. I'm not going to explain all the indicators. If you want to see that, I'll leave a link to the original video. He goes through all the indicators and what they do is actually, if this gets a bullish engulfing candle, this may actually enter a trade. Anyway, so you are going to use on this strategy, a smooth moving average, which is going to be set to the 100. If you want to, you can make it white and thicken the line so you can see it better. You're going to use the engulfing candles indicator and that's it's going to be stock. I added the swing highs and lows. So we're going to use that for our stop losses and take profits. The money flow index. Let's see which one is this. I've got it in my notes here. Money flow by dreams defined. He turned the plot line white and just made these the oversold and overbought areas darker. Also, we've got the price closes indicator that I added there at the end. So we have the current price being tracked at all times. So the premise of this strategy or the rules for this strategy, you are going to look for a long when the price closes above the 100 and then comes down and retests the 50. And then after it retests the 50, you're going to look for a green dot. So you retest the 50 right here, you get a green dot. Then you're looking for a bullish engulfing candle. The thing is, if this plot line on the money flow crosses up over the 20 line on the money flow, you're no longer Longer looking for that trade because you want it to be oversold when you get the long signal. So now my per my rules that I made in the strategy on Trade Lab, once it crosses up over this line, it's going to cancel the looking for a long and you're going to start over. So here it's going to set the look for a long retest variable and it's going to look for the cross of the 50, which happens right here. So it should have been looking for a long. It then would have been waiting for a green dot to go good for long. And then we're waiting for a bullish engulfing candle, which it got right here but if you look the price is above or the plot line is above the 20 so it's not going to take the trade so for a short you want price to close below the 100 you want then the price to retest the 50 ema and then you want it to be overbought like here's overbought so this closes above you get the retest you'd have been looking for a sell signal but it's kind of it's the op exact opposite of the long so if you get this red dot and then you get a, a bearish engulfing candle and it's still above 80 you're going to take the trade and it's going to be a one to two risk to reward ratio but once it gets to a one to one you want the stop loss to move to entry now I, I have not entered a trade yet i just built this a little bit ago let's go into our rules and go over them real quick so the rules that i know are working perfectly are my data rules so i've got instructions all the alert instructions are in here for all the different alerts we need. There's a bunch of them. There's a bunch of variables too in this strategy. So now that we've closed below, we're looking for a long, we're looking for a retest. That did not retest right there. So 
Let's go back to the strategy itself. Okay, that sh should have canceled. Looking for a long. This is the retest for the short. So if it gets oversold, then we're looking for, or over, yeah, overbought, then we're looking for the sell. Okay, here's my data, current price, price crossing up over the SMA. So we did that. So if we're looking, if we've got that one coming in, okay, money flow, chat GPT price steps. Hello. Price closes above, price closes below. Or when the closes above or below, it changes this to true. Or then when the retest, we're going to do set the long retest to true or short retest to true. Then we're waiting for that money flow dot. We want it to be but the red dot to be above 80, short retest to be true, then we're good to short. And then if we're looking for a long, we want the money flow value to be below, equal to or below 20, the long retest to be true, then that will cause the go long, or that is our, I do that. good to long to be true, that's correct. Money flow crosses up over oversold, that resets our looking for the trade variables here money flow crosses back the plot line crosses back up over that resets all that stuff that looks good then these are our entry signals good to long is true get a chat gpt long signal I'm gonna set the side to buy we have multiple stop lines in this so I've, I've did a backup just in case the swing high or swing low is not like if you're going long you want the stop loss at the swing low, right? But sometimes you your last swing low will be above the current price. So then it's not going to enter along. Or if it does, we don't want those lines on the chart. So what I did is I made lines for percentages and lines for dollar amounts. So if all of this math over here should give us a one to two risk to reward ratio, if the swing low and along is greater than the current price or the entry price, then we are going to turn off the dollar amount take lines stop lines and we're going to turn on the percentages and i just went with a 0.12 stop loss and then you double that for the take profit there's also a move stop line line in here so i did a do nothing line which once it hits that, you're going to have the stop loss move to the entry price. So that's the way the rules were set up in Trade IQ. So that's what I did here. I also have a stop line hit reset everything right here. So uh, I may have rambled and stuff, but I'm thinking my math is correct here. If you want to see the logic behind all of this, then check out the Trade Lab video. It's very long, very detailed, probably a lot of dead space of me thinking on how to do this. But I do explain my thought process behind it. This will be in the mini browser on trade lab which is right here you can look for the different strategies that i've done all you have to do is click on them hit copy setup and it puts it in your strategies list you can try it on different coins you can change different rules if you think something else would work better you can modify them however you want you can use this as just a basic template for another strategy you want to build but they will all be in here for you to use as you wish uh, if you don't have trade lab there's an affiliate link below there is a free option if you wanted to use just one exchange. I think the real value is in the $49 plan where you have unlimited strategies, unlimited exchanges, unlimited everything. But yeah, and you can always copy my bots or anybody else's bots on here. Some people are starting to do paid strategies. You could do that too if you're good at this. If you have a strategy idea you would like me to see build, leave it in the comments below. If there's anything you think I forgot, leave it in the comment below. Like, share, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.